Welcome back. Um, this might be the last part of this episode. This is a silver bullet. And it's gonna put Falcone down once and for all. I don't even want to know where you got this. No, you don't. Still, I gotta know one thing. Why give this to me? Don't get me wrong. I appreciate the hell out of this. Everyone on the force will, too. I heard you were the last honest man on the force. No need to blow smoke. I got enough cancer coming my way as it is. But thank you. Honestly. Knowing this evidence can lock up Falcone. <laughs> I'll sleep like a goddamn baby. For once. You know, as much as I appreciate you calling me here, I gotta make one thing crystal. I can't be bought. So you should know this isn't gonna change a thing about the investigation of your family. Wayne's always supported the Gotham police. So I'd like to believe there's no cloaks or daggers hidden in your closet. The investigation isn't the problem. It's the Wayne family name. Help me clear it. If your family's clean, I'll sing it from the rooftops. If they aren't, I'll still sing. You gotta understand, I'm bound to this badge. from a crime scene. Haven't been home yet. Sometimes I think this whole city's a crime scene. We're just walking through it. What you're holding will make walking it much safer. Thanks, Bruce. Well, Lieutenant? Hey, stick to Jim. It's done. Good. So is our hunt. The drones located Falcone downtown, a place called the Skyline Club. Although you're not dressed for that kind of party. Well, I can always change in the car. Yo! This is cool. Yo! <laughs> no way. Yo, that's cool. I got to admit, that is really cool. There he is, Batman himself.
boy Mickey in lockup again? Christ, Kimmy, what are they pinching for now? Some hit down at the dock. Mickey? No. I didn't think he was a hatchet man. You and me both. Well, has he got an alibi? Honey, I'm always his alibi. Yeah, it's really cool. Like, you can drive the job. Laying around? Yeah, no broken bones. Still yelling from the last time I died. All it took was a couple of C notes this time. Nice and easy. Nice and easy, my ass. I don't punch powder tonight. The whole city can stop. Stand by. A couple of options for taking this guy down. That could work. All right. All right. What about this guy? This one might be tricky. Let's go. Oh. Let's go. Oh. Get wrecked. Oh. 
bring it on. It worked, yes. Now! The Kellogg's. Where are they? What? I found your calling card at the docks. The White Rose. You think I wanted to leave you here? Yeah, something bleeps about this old thing. Games. Well, we played it, couldn't you? Those chemicals just so round up the map. They're mine, all right? But someone was trying to cut me out of the deal because I did not make that mess at the docks. Then who did? No, with that. What? What? 
the waves are behind us? Yo, this is messed up. Fire and smoke could reportedly be seen from street level. Tonight, the Skyline Club, a high-rise mafia hangout in downtown Gotham, was the arena for a clash between the notorious Batman and alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone, who was found dangling over a 50-story drop. Bet Falcone loved that view. Though I'd say the crime boss getting his is well overdue, Falcone has slipped through the law's grasp for years, but after this dramatic arrest and evidence released by the GCPD's Lieutenant Gordon, Falcone's going away for a long, long time. And speaking of newly uncovered criminal dealings, this brings me to the story everyone is talking about, the Wayne family. For generations, the big W on the Wayne Enterprises Tower was a reassuring sight. You knew that there was something pure at the heart of Gotham, that the city built by good people. But with Thomas and Martha's shining reputation called into question, we no longer have such assurances. And even worse, it seems the apple hasn't fallen far from the tree. Gotham's greatest son, Bruce Wayne, seen here shaking hands with Carmine Falcone, may be just as crooked as his parents. In his defense, Wayne fired back saying, The Wayne family has always been a cornerstone of Gotham. We've never had and never will have connections to organized crime. In a world where the Waynes, our golden family, are corrupt, who are we left with? Who can Gothamites look up to? The supposed hero Batman? Only time will tell. Meanwhile, we'll keep digging for the truth. But the prominent feeling throughout Gotham is that the Waynes' time in the sun is ending. What? That's the end of the episode? No. Mm, I did a right choice. Right choice also. I did a right choice. Choices, huh? Well, when your parents died, they left me as caretaker of their estate, their son, and their secrets. I would never. were good people, Bruce, no matter what that thump Falcone told you. And swear to me, there's no truth to it. The evidence you brought me on Falcone held up. Maybe I misjudged you. Now Batman's beating up mobsters, too. Wonder who he's after next. Wayne's name is toxic. I have to do what's best for my campaign. What's best for Gotham. I have to distance myself. Oh no. I will find the truth. Along with anyone who stands in my way. 
Yo! <laughs> no. Well, not now. Not now. Because my mom doesn't have any money. Yet. Alright, guys. Epic episode! Dude, that was epic. That was one of the best Batman games I've ever done. Wow. Alright, guys. Next episode. Yeah, next time. Alright, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video of Batman. Please like, subscribe, and as always, guys, peace.